Yo, Chuck, you good? Yeah, I'm fine. You sure? Yeah. Chuck, man, if nobody ever told you, you're a terrible liar. I take that as a compliment. I never considered lying a talent, but thanks. And thanks for the well, exquisite tap water as well. Well, you're welcome for both. What's wrong, man? Why you look so tired? Don't worry about me, man. I'm good. Come on, fool. I'm your brother. It's my job to worry about you. What's wrong? Talk to me. It's just that, uh, man, I was I was going over the hospital bill, man, we got, and it's a lot. If we keep getting ones that size, we might have to sell the house. All right. Come on, man. Sean's just going to take care of most of that. Don't trip. That's most of it. What about the rest, though? The savings can only do so much until we're emptied out. Look, I'm not worried about the money. I'm more worried about you. I don't want you to get overwhelmed more than this than I am. Yeah, that's easier said than done. I know, I know, and I'm glad you care so much. But you gotta remember to take care of yourself too, bro. I know, I know, I'm just, I'm just stressed out trying to think about why all this happened. I know why, because if it wasn't for this, you wouldn't be here and your ass would be out here in these streets where you almost got killed at. Chuck, I thought we agreed we were gonna leave that shit in the past. <laughs> Not when you think doing that could help anything involving me, man. I wasn't even thinking that. Good, you shouldn't be. Because I don't want anything involving drug money to have anything to do with me, bro. Look, I know you may be having a hard time handling this, but without a doubt, I know that through all of this, God is looking out for you. I would rather be me dying in a hospital bed than seeing you out there dying on the cold concrete. Don't say stuff like that, man. It's only stage two. Look at me. We're going to go through this. <laughs> I know, but you know what? Albeit, I'm grateful. Grateful? Yeah, man. This is... Like, think, when's the last time I seen you this often before, bro? Like, even though it took all the di <laughs> this. <laughs> Did we take any meds tonight? Yeah, I took my meds, but I need some more of that damn Doxel. Look, I'm going to run over to the pharmacy, man. It's only a couple blocks away, all right? Appreciate you, bro. Appreciate you. Hey, yo. What's up, man? You checked the mail today? Nah, I'm going to just grab it on my way back in, all right? I appreciate you, bro. All right. <coughs> I was going over the hospital bill, man. We got it. It's a lot. If we keep getting ones that size, we might have to sell the house. can only do so much until we're emptied out. It's a lot. If we keep getting ones that size, we might have to sell the house. I don't want anything involving drug money to have anything to do with me, bro. It's a lot. Leave this motherfucker. You okay?
okay? This ain't your avenue. What? what the fuck are you talking about? Don't play dumb with me. The rules say- I know the rules, nigga. This is Derek's block. Always has been. Oh, you Derek's boy, huh? I got news for you. This ain't a set. So you need to go ahead. You must not know the fucking territory because this ain't your block. Oh, is that so? Yeah. Empty them pockets. Come for no trouble, brother. Got it. Back up. Back up. Pleasure doing business with you. Yo, I can't get some of that back from my brother's chemo. You think I give a shit about your brother? Or pa? Or your girlfriend? Or your baby sister? Well, guess what? I don't. In fact, why don't you give me her address? That way I can pay her a visit so I can walk into her bedroom, do whatever I feel like doing, and when I'm done, I'll blast her face off while you watch. Hey Chuck, Chuck, can we talk? Chuck. Yo Chuck, where you at man? Hello? Yo Chuck. Hello? Chuck. Nick, where you at, man? I'm right here. Who the fuck turn on these lights? Hello? Chuck, I'm right here. Hello? Where is he at? Where's this boy this late? Who's knocking on my door? Yo, Chuck, what you doing, man? I'm right here. <sighs> I don't know who's knocking on the door goddamn late like they the police. Chuck, where are you going? Nick! Nick! Chuck, Chuck, man, you gotta stop playing. <coughs> I'm right here. <coughs> Nick! <coughs> Whatever you're doing, it's not even funny anymore. Oh, how late is it, man? I'm being Where serious. Man. I need to talk to you. <coughs> Chuck! Nick! <coughs> Nick, I hope your goofy ass got my medicine. I feel like fucking shit, man. Come on, Nick. I'm your goofy ass in here, man. The fuck you want, man? May I come in? Got something I need to tell you. I'd rather you be sitting to hear this. <laughs> it's too late for this shit, man. Nick! What the fuck that boy did, man? Detective Brown? Mm -hmm. Oh. Can you take a seat? I'm good, man. Just what you gotta say. Where Nick at? He ain't Nick. What are you in trouble now? I, I go bond them. Oh, look, we ain't got that much money. I don't, I look, I don't know how to tell you this, but about five o'clock this morning, <coughs> we received a call about a shooting about a few blocks back. And um, we arrived on the scene and discovered, I don't know how to tell you this, but we have to inform you that Nick was murdered. What you mean Nick was murdered? 
Where's my I'm brother? Sorry, I have to tell you this. Where's my brother? I'm sorry, Where's Mr. my brother? I'm sorry, Mr. Hunt. Where's my brother? He's not di- Chuck. Chuck. Louis? I can give you some cream if you want. Sure, I mean, if it can help. It is kind of expensive, so don't go overusing it now, all right? Kate. Are you okay? Is it really you? Yes, of course it is. Babe, I'm worried about you. Would you please just talk to me a little bit? Okay. Sure. What happened yesterday? Why are you so scared? Like, scared of me? I wasn't scared of you. It was something else. What? What was it? I... I messed up really bad. What I did... It, it's haunting me. What did you do? I hurt someone, Kate. Really, really bad. Did you mean to do it? I don't think so. I don't know. It's been eating me up inside. I don't know what to do. Listen, babe. I might not know exactly what to do, but staying like this, it's not going to solve your problem. Please, we'll just come out and let's talk about this. I, I want to see you again. Is there anyone else there right now? Okay then, I'll come out. Thank you. 
Yeah. Kate, where are you? I'm right here. Let me see. Follow me. You think I give a shit about your brother? Or pa? Or your girlfriend? Or your baby sister? Well, guess what? I don't. In fact, why don't you give me her address? That way I can pay her a visit so I can walk into her bedroom. Do whatever I feel like doing. And when I'm done, stop. I'll blast her face off while you watch. Please. I ain't mean to do it. I'm sorry. I don't care. I ain't mean to do it. I ain't mean to hurt you. Why? I swear I ain't lying. I ain't mean to kill you. I pleaded with you. I hope you had the slightest amount of sympathy for my brother who was dying from cancer. Do you remember what you said instead? You said, fuck me, and fuck him too. You took me from him. And you took him from me. You killed him too. No. No, what? It was only you. It was no one else. Wrong. What do you mean? He had heart cancer. If you didn't know, stressful situations were dangerous to him. So when the cops came and told him that his brother he just spoke to a few hours earlier had been murdered, what do you think happened after that? He had a heart attack in my living room. Well, all I could do was watch it happen. That's half your sick fantasy. Are you happy now you fucking coward? <laughs> I'll do anything. Just stop. Turn yourself in and confess. If I turn myself in, they'll give me the needle anyway. I don't care. What's better? 25 years of a crap quiet cell or a lifetime of me? I'll give me a priest, an exorcist, or anybody. And you'll leave me alone for good. I'm not a demon. No incantation is going to get rid of me. There's nothing you can do to push me away or pretend I'm not here. Hey, yo, I'll find a way. Look all you want, but every step you take there, I'm going to be moving over you. I'll never let you rest again. Not another moment. The only amount of comments you'll ever be able to find again is when you're in a drug-induced coma. Why can't you just rest in peace?
Welcome to my world. Thank you. 